Okay, folks, I'm going to take a minute out of the action right now just to mention we are on Facebook. Punch in RCTV on Facebook and check us out. Send in your pictures, send in your videos, right? Or if you want to just say hi to me or the cameraman or the producers or anybody on the crew. Facebook, folks, check it out. Wes is supposed to be interviewing me, but he's playing. Can't stop. Track is too much fun. Hey, Jack. Okay. Okay. There we go. All right, we're talking to Tanya here from Rock City Raceway about the what a bummer end of summer classic they got going on here. She so, got it wrong. I got it wrong. Yeah. Okay. What a bummer! It's the end of summer wham bam off road jam. There we go. Right from the mouth of the person who wrote it. So, how long's the track been here? Here, year and a half. Year and a half. Yeah, we redid it this spring and uh, made it quite a bit bigger. Lengthened it by about 30 feet. Mm -hmm. And it looks like you're running a really cool family program here. This is the first track I've been to a long time. There's been a lot of kids involved in the racing with their parents. Yep. We have a whole range of ages that do this, anywhere from four years old up to 73 years old. 73 years old. Yeah. Today we have 108, but we've set up the race so that we can have people come in just for Sunday. Because for a lot of people, it's hard to commit to two days uh, for the last race of the summer. So 108 today, and we're expecting about another 30 to 40 tomorrow. Could be the biggest race of the year. Cool. So how's the qualifying going to go if you don't show up for the day before? Uh, it'll just goes by your best qualifier. Yeah, so we have a last chance qualifier tomorrow morning and then the mains after that. So it's just like the old days. I noticed that your uh, race starting was all, everybody all at once. Yeah, heads like, up. Yep, so a heads yeah. up start and you get the best chance for your qualifier to put you into the yeah, AMA. Yeah, we're big believers in heads up racing. Uh, otherwise, when you get to the main, nobody knows what to do. Now I hear that you were like the top six woman racer in Western Canada. I think I'm top girl in BC. When we just did the Cork series, we did all of them, Kamloops, Kelowna, and um, Coquitlam. And two-wheel drive short course, I think, I haven't seen the final results yet, but I think I'm sixth overall. First two-wheel drive short course, and then stadium truck, maybe eighth overall. And is that running against the guys too? Yeah. So oh, yeah. actually, you're faster than the guys that yeah. are out there. Yeah. So fast woman kicking on the guys. I'm pretty sure there's quite a few of them here today that I beat in Kukwet, or in Kamloops. Do you have anything to maybe say to the Glork Series girls from back east? You girls think you're fast? Come out west, see what you got. Well, we're talking to Nick Fridge here about the race he was just in. How'd you do? I did pretty good. I was in first for three quarters of it, but I got hung up in a couple of crashes. I came in second with this. This is called the one eight scale buggy, and it has a lot of horsepower. So when you get on the throttle, it really takes off. What else do you race? I race my two wheel drive short course. I just got this body. It's really nice and it's really good through the air so it doesn't go like this. And I came in first with this one. Cool. Yeah. So I hear you're beating up on a lot of the older guys here. Yeah, I have been doing pretty good for the past few weeks, but when I first started, it was pretty hard to be in the top three because they were so good. So how long have you been racing now? I've been racing since last July, I'm pretty sure. Why do you like to do this? I like doing this because they're all a really nice bunch of guys. When I first started, there was a couple guys that helped a lot, and there was a, they're all the guys help, but there's a few guys that really helped me move along, and now when other people start, we help them, and they always say thanks. So it's a nice community out here, and it's, I just enjoy racing. Well, there you go, an interview with the coolest guy at this track. So here's Chella, and she's racing here today. Another girl racer coming up from the bottom, working your way to the top, fastest in Canada. So how are you doing today at the track? Good, how are you? <laughs> Fine, <laughs> but uh, what kind of car do you race? I race a truck. Yep. It is um, greenish, it's green, and it has silver on it. So how'd you do so far in the racing today? Good, I 
wasn't the best. There's something wrong with the truck um, on my first lap. I was going around to get to the bakery and it died on me. So how do you like it so far? Is this fun? Yeah, I like it. It's actually a lot of fun. Yeah? Yeah, and especially to be the marshal. Oh, you like marshalling the cars, running around, flipping them back on their wheels? Yeah. Is Tanya kind of your hero because she's like the sixth fastest person in British Columbia? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You think you're going to stick with the sport? You like it a lot? Yeah, I think I, I like it. I like the racing. It's a lot of fun. I just like racing. I'm going to continue it. We'd like to thank Nanaimo RC for having us out today to the What a Bummer End of Summer Wham Bam Off-Road Jam. Thanks for watching. See you guys later.